I've got two tuning forks here. And these two tuning forks are mounted on boxes. You can hear what the sounds like. Now that tuning fork is G, it's a certain frequency. If I hit this one, it's the same sound as this one. So these two tuning forks are exactly the same. Now if I took a different tuning fork with this tuning fork, and if I hit it and mounted it on the box, it's a different sound. This is a G, this is an E if you know your music. And you can hear that sounds quite a bit different than this one. But let me show you what's really neat about this, what really is interesting about this. If I hit one of these forks, like I want to hit this one, but I'm not going to touch that one. So, and you see this one sitting over here by itself. And I hit that one. Watch. Whoa. Do you see that? That one wasn't connected to this one. It's not touching it at all. They're sitting on feet. They don't have any connection at all. But if I hit this one, the other one picks it up. Now, if I did it the other way around, if I hit this one, then that one picks it up. Now, if I do that with one of these different forks, if I use E, now let me do that here. If I hit the E, Nobody picks it up. Do you understand what that means? Everything in the creation has a certain frequency at which it vibrates. Different sounds come out of different things depending upon what they're made of and how big they are. So if I have two tuning forks here that are not exactly the same, you can see that this one is a little bit longer than this one. And you heard what this one sounds like. Let me hit it again and let you hear that. Now, if I take this one and put it on there, listen to what it sounds like. And remember, this one's different yet. Everything has its own frequency.